If you're watching this video, that means you're reading our email, which is telling about how we change the names of our classes to reflect the type of tennis ball that is going to be used in our junior classes. We've got our foam ball right here, and then we advance to the red, and you'll notice we have a class called red. And then from that, they advance to the green. That's wrong. They move to the orange right there, <laughs> and then they move up to the green dot. So you might ask, what's the difference in the tennis ball? So basically, it's how they bounce, and also the size, obviously. These will make our younger kids have an easier time rallying in their classes. All right, so here we got the big foam ball. This is the foam ball going back and forth. Outdoors, it can float around a little bit, but indoors, it's no problem at all. And you can see the bounce on this. Very easy for younger kids to start rallying. Here is the red. So you'll notice when you sign up for a class for the kids in that appropriate age, you will use the red tennis ball predominantly in that class. It's got a different sound to it, bounces pretty low, but it's a great tennis ball for that age to start with. And we have the orange. Cool, so this is the orange ball. This is pretty much, I think, ages seven to nine in our programming. And this ball starts going a little bit faster and it's smaller. And you can see, even at this age, they can rally pretty well with this orange ball. Green dot is next. So the green dot. This is when kids can actually start playing USTA tournaments too. Ten and under tournaments are utilizing the green dot tournament. We have a few of those at South Shore this year. This bounces about 20% slower than a yellow tennis ball, which is coming up next. Then we have the real ball, or the yellow ball, as it's referred to. Hannah, take that. So this is the real ball. This is what they advance to when they hit 11 years old, sometimes younger, totally depends on the kid and the level. But So that is the progression of the tennis balls that we use at South Shore. We go from the foam balls to the red. What's after the red, Hannah? The orange. And then what? The green dot. Yes, and after the green, then it goes to the yellow ball or the real ball. So anyway, that's how we uh, run things at South Shore with the junior program, and I hope that explains how we came up with the names of the classes. Thanks.